First alert traffic. Thank you very much, Caroline. We're connected to cooking here in the Good Day Alabama kitchen. We got Carapuccio here from uh, Nuke's Eatery. We got this uh, fall themed, Halloween themed uh, setup here, but we're making something very delicious today. Yes. And that is the Supreme Pizza. Supreme Pizza. All right. So let's tell us, how, folks, how do we start here? Okay. So we have our pizza dough, and then we are going to start out with our pizza sauce. And by the way, uh, I, 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 when I make homemade pizza, I, I do it the lazy way. What is that? I, I buy the pre made, you know, dough sliced pizza or dough shaped pizzas. Okay. Pizza dough. Well, but, okay. but obviously you can get the dough yourself and knead it out and do it yourself. Absolutely. Right? Now, do y'all do yours in house? We do not. It okay, comes see? in from our company. Now I don't feel, now I don't feel no. so, so. Don't feel so lazy. Uh, all right. So now <laughs> what do we, we got this, we got some uh, sauce there. Our mozzarella. Yeah, we put our pizza sauce down. This is going to okay. be our mozzarella cheese we're going to put on it. Okay. And then we are going to go with our pepperoni. Mm -hmm. Best part. We put 12 on ours. You can do more if you like extra. Now, a lot of stuff y'all you, you do do in house or source. We do. Yeah, yeah, okay. We do. All right, so those are those are pretty okay. simple. Uh, simple. That's a good size pizza too, right there for individual. I'd eat that. It is. Thing. This is 10 inches. This is what it's. That a sandwich, yeah. Italian sausage. Italian sausage yeah. works best. Uh, do you ever, you ever go eat spicy sometimes? I'm talking about in the restaurant at home. I'm not a spicy. You're not eater. a spicy. No. See, I'll have every now I'll and then. I'll, I'll do kaneka. You know, I'll do something like that. You could right? do that. Yeah, you could add extra to this. All right. So now we're going to go with our red and yellow bell peppers. Fresh peppers. Okay, those have some. Uh, those have some healthy uh, antioxidants, by the way. Yeah. And they're nice and sweet. Mm -hmm. Okay. And everybody likes the peppers. Peppercinis. Ah, uh, now this is the magic the ingredient this here. Is I, nice. Megan came walking through a moment ago. She yep. loves these, as do I, on several different things. But man, on pizza. Uh, if you want to kick it up a notch, this is one way to do it. To add a little bit of heat. It's uh, and it's not overbearing heat. You know what I mean? It's, no. It's just a, just Good. enough. Just enough. Just enough. Yeah. All right. Onions. You yes. either love them not or a, you hate them. <laughs> Janice is not a fan. Janice. Uh, you either love them or you hate them. Yeah, so, but uh, those are good. Uh, do you, and those kind on a pizza seem to work best better for me. They I do. Don't know how other people feel. They do. Yeah. All right. All right, and then we're going to put this in the oven. All right, so how long do we put it in there? Like most people at home, their oven, how long would they put it in? I would, depending on their oven, I'd do 425 to 450. Okay. And about 10 minutes. 10 minutes, okay. Okay. And That's then true. when it comes out, we're going to top it with our fresh basil. And this is what our pizza looks like. All right, because some, everybody's oven's different. Yep. You know, like I'll sometimes will half a frozen one if I'm, and it's rare I'm eating a frozen pizza. Yeah. But I'll half it put the half in the toaster oven because it cooks quicker. It does. So, uh, but it, but the time has, the timing on it. I would it, decrease it, it, yes. So what are you looking for to make sure that it's done? So you want the nice brown crisp edge. Some people like their pizza dough a little softer and then some people like it thin and crispy. So we kind of go more for the thin and crispy okay, in our right. restaurant. We're going to throw that in the oven, let yep. that cook. A very simple recipe, we'll post it later. And if you want any of the recipes, you just go to the app or the website. Upper left screen, there's a drop down menu. Go to Good Day Alabama and then connect it through cooking. And by the way, Nukes now has their uh, their spice cake, your seasonal that spice cake. That is our pumpkin, spice, pumpkin cake spice cake that we have out. And then we also have our new wraps okay. that we've launched those as well. Mm -hmm. It's a delicious morning here on Good Day Alabama. Great. We'll be right back. Stick Thank around. You.